सो दिस इज ए क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम कैलेंडर चैप्टर आस्क बाई यूपीएससी इन दर सी सेट पेपर ऑफ टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी इन ए पर्टिकुलर ईयर ट्वेल्थ जनवरी दिस क्वेश्चन इज टॉकिंग अबाउट एनी पर्टिकुलर ईयर राइट ट्वेल्थ जनवरी इज संडे देन विच वन ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इज करेक्ट राइट सो फिफ्टीन जुलाई इज ए संडे सो वी हैव टू फाइंड इफ सपोज देर इज एनी ईयर वी डोंट नो विच ईयर इज दिस दिस इज ऑर्डनरी ईयर और लीप ईयर दिस इन्फॉर्मेशन इज नॉट गिवन राइट सो वॉट दे हैव गिवन दे हैव गिवन दैट on 12th january there is sunday right so now we have to consider for 15th july is a sunday if the year is leap year and not a leap year so we have to consider both the cases right then 12th july right so we will consider for 12th july right because if we know 12th july we can compute 15th july easily right but if we are uh, going for 15th july then we have to backtrack for 12th july both are possible but i am doing with 12th july right so suppose this is a ordinary year so now we will write january february march april may june july right so in january 12th july, uh, january we know so how many days are remaining is 19 days are remaining right because january have 31 days right now in february i am considering first ordinary year so in ordinary year there will be 28 days in february so in march there will be 31 days right in april there will be 30 days in may again 31 june 30 days and in july we are computing for 12th july so 12 days we will write so now the odd day will be here how many odd day we will divide with 7 right 7 to the 14 how many are remaining 5 here zero odd days and here three odd days and here two odd days here three Again two, and this twelve. How many odd days? Five. Right. Now, total how many odd days are there? These are odd days. Five plus three, eight. Eight plus two, ten plus three, thirteen plus two, fifteen plus five, twenty. So total twenty odd days. Twenty odd days means six. Six odd days. Right. So twelfth January is Sunday. This Sunday. right so sixth odd day it means there will be saturday right on 12th july okay so that 12th july will be saturday right and what will be the 15th july 15th july will be 3 days after it right so this will be saturday then sunday monday tuesday so 15th july will be tuesday so we are talking about ordinary year right now we will consider for the leap year if this is a leap year then what will happen if this is a leap year all this will remain same just this here in the february this zero will get converted into one because there will be 29 days right so one odd day will be there right so total was 20 so this will become now 21 right so if this is 20, 21 then the odd day will be zero odd day will be zero in a leap year If the odd day is zero, then if on twelfth January there is Sunday, then on twelfth July there will also be Sunday, right? And then fifteenth July will be what? Three days after it, right? So this will be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So this will be Wednesday. Now we will check from the options. Now the first option, fifteenth July is a Sunday. This is wrong. This is not a Sunday, right? This is a is talking about leap year so in a leap year this is wednesday so this option is wrong now 15th july is a sunday if it is a not a leap year so not a leap year we have already considered here so this is a tuesday here so this option is also wrong right now the third option 12th july is a sunday so 12th july is a sunday right if the year is a leap year so this is right in a leap year 12th july is a sunday so this option is correct right so the answer is option c and what is the next option let's read it also 12th july is not sunday if the year is a leap year no this is also wrong because the year is a leap year in a leap year the this option is saying not sunday but we are getting sunday right so this option is also wrong so the answer of this question is option c i hope you guys got it right if you guys still have some issues in this then you can connect with us and i will explain you this question personally again